let me say this. You all have spoken. You all have preached. And again, you all have been heard. And I have delivered. This, this right here is the finale you have been waiting for. I put hours, days, weeks, and months into this project just for you guys. And the reason why I did this is because I felt like I left the second part off unfinished. I felt like something was missing and that something is right here, right now. At this very moment, I am pleased to say that I've tried my very best to make this as slick as possible. I've tried my very best to make this as authentic as I can. And with the help of my friends, this entire thing was completely possible. Before we get into the finale, go ahead, grab some snacks and make yourself comfortable. And a quick disclaimer, this premiere is not for kids. As any prop that was used in the making of this video is not real, we still want kids to be out of the room during this time. This is complete fiction. Nothing more, nothing less. Mild language is used, so don't say I didn't warn you. The premiere will begin in one minute. A few months have passed. Nothing has really changed ever since that whole thing went down. Remember that guy that appeared out of nowhere in my kitchen? Little did I know that was his brother. It's strange. I never even got to know either of their names. And neither did you. Hmm. You know what? As I think about it, I wonder if that guy that was in my kitchen a few nights ago was alright. Yo, guy, you down here? Oh, whoa. Who did this to you? My, my, looks like we have a little bit of a mess here now, don't we? Though it's just a mask. It's a shame that I had to execute my own brother. No, 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 no. Not again. Not for a third time, no, not again. It can't be you again. And then you showed up. Surprise, surprise. Still thinking you can make it to 1K, huh? It ends here. You're not gonna make it. Not by a long shot. So I suggest you stop before you embarrass yourself. Got nothing to say? Well then, let me tell you something. My brother had a lot of faith in you, Shy. And I mean a lot. He's never doubted you from the beginning. But if someone like that comes in the way of my business, I'll have to make him disappear. And it's hard to make someone disappear. But making my brother disappear on the other hand, well that was just too easy. So you killed him? Just because he had faith in me? You killed him because he believed that I could make it to 1K? Correct. In my business of bringing the system to make sure you never get your goal, I've been having some growing concerns that my plan will be ruined. So to prevent my plan from being announced to outsiders, I had to take matters into my own hands. Meaning, I had to kill whoever was in my way. I guess that means I'm next then. Oh no, on the contrary. I have a deal for you. If you stop making content, then I'll leave you be. You'll never have to see me again. Sound good? And if I refuse? If you refuse, then we're gonna have some unfortunate casualties. So, What's your decision? 
fine. I'll stop making content. Good choice. Well, the deal's a deal. See ya. And now, five months later, I'm here, doing jobs for Gene, aka The Godfather. You might be wondering where that guy is now. Apparently he died when everyone from the FBI found out about his plan of rigging the system and everything else with it. After that, rumors went around stating that he had a sister who helped with the rigging and is nowhere to be found. Some say that she died along with him, while others say that she's hiding in order to not be detected by any form of security. But for now, no one really knows if she's still around or not. It's a mystery. A forgotten mystery. So let me get this straight. You're late on your rent again. Oh, come on, man. Just give me more time. I've given you two weeks, man. Two weeks, and you still don't have the money. I'll take care of some things, man. Please give me more time, and I'll pay you double next week. Fine, but this is your last chance. And if you miss the deadline this time, you're gonna have to deal with my boss, and he hates when his money is late. All right, I'll make the deadline this time. You better make this deadline or I'm losing fingers. All right, meeting, let's go. Wait, meeting? Since when are we gonna have a meeting? Did I stutter? Let's go, meeting. I don't got time to wait for you. All right, all right, all right, I'm going, I'm going. I you need to start questioning my authority, man. Whatever I say goes, and you should know that by now. All right, so as you all know, we have some new people with us today. We have Shy, Ghost, and Trickster. So why don't you three come up here and introduce yourselves and tell us why you're here. I'll go first. You have the floor. Name Shy. I'm here because I've been tracked by someone who has been watching my every move since day one. Look, long story short, I made a deal with the devil. He told me if I stopped doing what I was doing, he'd leave me alone. And if I didn't comply, he'd kill me. Look, I'm not gonna go into full detail, but that's what basically happened. All right, now it's my turn. <clears throat> my name's Trickster. I guess you could say I'm a little creative, but who's to say I'm not fun? I don't like to get festive for occasions. Anyways, let me get to the point. I'm an absolute psycho. Cops couldn't find me. FBI couldn't figure out my patterns. Until one night, when they actually caught me, or so they think, I had to fake my death to get them off my trail. Anyways, one problem led to another. Ended up here. Wanted to lay low for a while. I'm Ghost. I'm here because the FBI is flagging me as a potential risk. They've been keeping an eye on me for some time now. Every move, every bite, and every look, and every breath I took was being recorded. They have every possible enforcer out there looking for me, and that's why I keep my hood on to hide my identity. And just like you all, I'm here because I want to lay low. Interesting. Now that we've gotten that out of the way, let's talk operations. You three will need to pay attention because this involves you all to do most of the heavy lifting. I hope it includes some type of destruction. I've been aching to blow something up for weeks. When it comes down to it, most likely we will need to cause destruction. Fair enough. Now, I need the three of you to get something for me. Something that is very important. What might that something be? This something is a watch. 
that whenever the user wears it, they'll have complete control over the system. Why do you want control over the system? Wait, Shy. That introduction. That story you told me. Yeah, what about my introduction? That person that you said you made a deal with. Yeah? He's been after that watch for months. And when he and his sister disappeared, his sister vowed to get it by any means necessary. That includes leaving a blood trail. So she's still out there then? Yes, and if she happens to show up during the operation, then we're going to have a real problem. I see. Her brother's dead, but she's ten times worse now. Correct. And that's why I want you three to grab her before she does. Just to be clear, who is this so-called sister you keep mentioning? Her name's Yuichi. She's one of the most feared people around here. You look at her the wrong way and she'll slaughter you into pieces. And I should know. Because I've worked with her before. So you've seen what she's capable of? Regretfully, yes. I wish I'd never seen any of it. But in this instance, I'm glad I did. So I can at least warn people about her capabilities. Wait, 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 wait. Let me get this straight. We have to steal a watch that can give control to the entire system, and we have to go up against Miss Killjoy? Doesn't that sound a little bit like suicide to you? Coming from a self-proclaimed psychopath, I thought you'd be up to this kind of stuff. I am! I'm just trying to figure out things before it actually goes down. Well, first, we need a strategy. Right, but how much info do we have? Well, the watch isn't always in the same place, so there must be a pattern to where they relocate the watch every time. I say we go in while they're relocating it. Take them by surprise, you know? What if they amped up security and they know we're coming? Shai's right, they might have extra enforcers to keep everything in order. Not only that, but they might have snipers on the rooftops to make sure that no one even gets close to the watch. Then we take them out, duh! And we'll die a lot faster! Enough! You have all made very good observations and scenarios involving this operation. But the security will be light. They won't be expecting anything to go wrong with the transport. So this is the only chance we'll get to do this operation successfully. There's no room for error. No drawbacks. No miscalculations. Do I make myself clear? Yes, yes sir. sir! Now, let's get this operation rolling. Everyone in position? Yeah, explosives are in place. Okay, good. What about you, Ghost? What's happening? Everything seems to be going smoothly. Nothing's really happening, but uh, I'll keep a lookout. As you should. What's on your ranch, I? Everything's quiet. Not much is going on right now. Alright, but remember to keep watch for any suspicious activity. I can't be too sure about anyone not showing up and throwing this whole thing off. Gotcha. It's on the explosive. On it. Wait, sure. Since the transport's behind you, but no one's there. Explosives are offline. Good. Now take care of the two officers. Do not kill them. Handling it now. Huh? Ghost's right. I see it too. I'm not picking up any signals of anyone near there. They're right, Shy. I have no detection of anyone near you three, but don't take any chances. It could be a trap. I'm gonna see if it's the actual thing we're looking for. Alright, but be careful. You two, keep a lookout. Already on it. Ghost. Did you get that? Ghost. Ghost. You there? Don't make any sudden movements. the watch. Whoa, 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 I'm picking up signals near you. Shy, get out of there. Trick's right, you need to move now, that signal's moving fast. Alright, I'm going. Hello there, Shy. Gene, who, who is that? We suggest you not to speak or make any movements. Yuichi. Congratulations, you finally know who I am, Gene. What do you want from us? What I want is simple. I want you to give me back the watch you stole. You're not getting the watch. Then perhaps Shy would like to do it for you. Shy, whatever you do, do not give her the watch. She'll... she'll use it to... Don't you just hate it when someone's voice is in your ear? I suggest you hand over the watch now. Why should I give it to you? What are you gonna do with it? That information is not... Ghost! Disabled comms. Let me see if I can reset them. But if I do that, the backups will kick in and disable the security and possibly get me killed. It's a risk I'm willing to take. 
I almost got killed back there, man. You didn't tell me this dude had a knife on him. That doesn't matter. I specifically told you not to kill them. Did I not make myself clear? Now we have to kill these two. I see we're gonna act like I didn't almost get killed back there, huh? Hey, bright side, I got his weapon. Well, if it's a war you want, then it's a war you get. Got it. Guys, can you hear me? Yeah, Gene, what happened? Yuichi disabled comms, but I got him working again. What's going on over there? Why do I hear bullets flying? Long story short, Ghost is dead, and now we're pinned down out here with Yuichi and her partner shooting at us. It's worse than I thought. You need to get out of there. We'll try. Just make sure no one gets into the base. Um, about that. I had to disable security to get the comms working again. Yuichi's in our system, rooting through our files and disabling everything we have. You're kidding, right? No, I'm not. And if I don't make it out of here, look out for each other and keep that watch close to you at all times. Got it. Get somewhere. Gene, Gene, Gene. I have some ice cream for you. I ain't over the watch. And now look what happened. You have one arm with them, and the two are fighting for their lives. What has it going to end, huh, Gene? The never ending blood trail you everywhere you go. You, out of every one of them, should know that I don't leave trails. After everything you did, I've done nothing but keep you from destroying our fabric of existence. You've never understood anything that I've done, have you? I'm saving everyone from the relapse of endless torture, and you've done nothing but get in my way. It's about time that I look for your remaining overdose and pay them a little visit, and there's nothing you can do to stop me. Gotta... Do a hard reset. Make sure she doesn't get anything. Wipe everything clean. If you can still hear me, though I doubt you can, keep a lookout for each other. And keep that watch close to you at all times. Don't let your guard down for a second. Is something wrong? You've been looking out that window for about 20 minutes, so I just asked. You're thinking about what happened that night, huh? Gene and Ghost are gone. Just get over it. Just get over it. Just get over it. How are you gonna tell me to just get over it, huh? I've done things on that night that I regret doing because he dragged me into this. Yeah, Ghost and Gene are dead, but for what? I can't take what I did back. Don't go there with me, man. Do you know how many dead bodies I've seen before even stepping into this mess? A lot. Countless bodies of innocent people caught in the crossfire. Oh, spare me the drama. You try falling asleep at night and hearing the haunting screams of innocent people. I didn't ask to be dragged into this, but now we have to follow through and finish what we started. Well, since you want to call the shots, what's the plan, leader? We take her out. We find out where she's hiding and kill her right on the spot. In and out. That's it. It can't be that simple. Unless you want to end up in a fiery death or with a bullet through your skull, you'd follow through with the idea. I'd follow through with it, but what about the guard that killed Ghost? Don't we need to take him out first? Yeah, that could work. So we take out the guard and get Yuichi after it, while keeping the watch safe. I got another plan. I'll put on the watch. It can control the entire system, so... If Yuichi has control without having the watch, then maybe I can reprogram it to take over the system and render her powerless. Now that sounds like a plan. Alright, so I'll handle the guard while you set up that watch. Alright then. So it's a go? Yeah, it's a definite go. Alright then. Let's wreak havoc. Alright, watch. Let's see what you can do. Okay. Hey, what's good, Trick? I took care of our little problem area. Okay. Yeah, it's kind of a shame that the audience couldn't see it. Yeah, that battle would have been intense. Anyways, back on topic. What's the ETA on the little watch situation? I think I can counter her control over the system now with the watch being set to disable the current operator. So the watch can... Kill Yuichi if it reaches full control. Yes. The watch gives you control, so you can eliminate her if she attempts to get back in. Exactly. But it'll fire off a warning shot the first time. The second time, it'll probably kill her. Alright, shy. Ghost and Jean would be proud right about now. 
yeah. Now let's finish this. I'm with you on that. We have no idea what they're going up against. We have to congratulate them on getting this far. No one has ever grown the courage to stand up to me. But that courage won't be broken once I step through those doors. So I won't have anything to worry about. I wish I could have said the same thing for my brother. But even he was so self-absorbed that he got caught in his own web of lies and deceit. I pity him. Oh, how I pity him. Trick. Yeah? Guess what? What? I found her. Then what are we waiting for? Let's go get her! Oh, hello, Shy. Trick said. What brings you here? Shut up and stop playing dumb, Yuichi. Your plan of manipulation and control ends here. Manipulation? Control? My plan was never about you in the first place. You see, I wanted to get into the system to get to you. After all, you did make a deal with my brother, right? What? Tongue shot. You, all people, should know who I'm talking about. Oh god, not this again. Shy, what does she mean by that? Go on, Shy. It's time to tell him the full story. Alright, fine. A few months back, I met this unknown person, i.e. her brother. He appeared out of nowhere and started messing with my head. Then, his other brother came along and tried to give me more info on him. And after that night, I never saw him again. Oh, what a sad story. Shy! <sighs> And it never will. You killed Jean, Ghost, and everyone else that stood up to you. And for what? Just so you could have control and end our entire existence? What do you have to gain from this? This. Shy! Do it now! <laughs> what the hell happened? You reverse engineered it? That's right. You should have given up when you had the chance. And now I'm about to do you like you did your brother. Don't. She's not worth a bullet. I just want to make sure this never happens again. I'll handle it. All those people you killed. Your kin. Our friends. You even had your own guard killed by me. Take this as a sign of ending it all. The mass murder. The manipulation. The torture. Well, what, what are you doing? doing? Making sure you go quietly. <sighs> She's gone. Let's get out of here. Hold on. To get my final words. I guess you should have stayed in your place. I only got a few words to say to you. Make sure you say hi to your brother for me. <laughs> See you around. got rid of Yuichi for good this time. Yeah, me too. I mean, after all that, everything has been normal in a sense. Yeah. Hey, I, I know it's none of my business, but what are you gonna do now? I might get back to doing what I do best. Making content. Well, alright then. I'll see you around, Shai. Later, Trick. Oh, and uh, thanks for everything. Yeah, no problem. Oh, uh, here you go. A little sum for your troubles. You're, you're giving me your bandana? Yeah, well, I figured that you helped me out. I might as well give you something in return. You know, something to at least remember me by. Thanks, man. I, I really don't know what to say. Eh, don't mention it. Until next time. If there is ever a next time. Now, where was I? <clears throat> Thank <laughs> you.
Is it working still? It's working. Hey guys, what's going on? <laughs>